Hi there, my fellow software enthusiasts. Imagine this scenario. You're just about to launch your software, feeling confident, and then a last-minute bug pops up. The race against the clock begins. Frustration sets in, and the tension becomes overwhelming. Today I'll share a practical approach that can save you from these nerve-wracking moments. And I'm talking about shift-left testing, but it's not just about the technical side. Shift-left testing is an integral part of DevOps practices, fostering a culture of collaboration and continuous improvement. Developers and testers work hand-in-hand, -hand, ensuring the best possible outcome for our end users. So why do developers rave about shift left testing? Let's uncover the perks, shall we? First up, we have early defect detection and resolution. By catching those pesky bugs sooner, we save ourselves from nightmare of fixing issues later in the software development cycle. And hey, that also means saving some precious bugs along the way. Next on the list is improved collaboration and communication. Picture this, development and testing teams working hand in hand, understanding requirements better and collaborating like never before. It's like a harmonious dance of code and tests. Faster feedback loops. With shift left testing, we are able to identify and squash bugs at lightning speed. That means no more waiting around for surprises to pop up. We get things fixed pronto and keep the software train running smoothly. Time is also of essence, isn't it? That's where reduced time to market comes into play. With shift left testing, development and testing activities happen simultaneously. Like a synchronized symphony. The result? Faster software releases and a happy customer base. Last but definitely not least, improved software quality. By catching those bugs early on, we are ensuring a higher level of quality. It's like a superhero shield protecting our software from the clutches of pesky bugs. Pretty neat, huh? The benefits of shift left testing can go on and on, my friends. But it's all about how you implement it. So let's talk implementation. But before we dive into this topic, I want to remind you that if you want to stay in the loop and keep up with the latest in QA management and software testing, subscribe to the AquaCloud YouTube channel. This way, you'll always be in the know about the newest testing trends and industry news. Now let's get back to how you can implement shift left testing. Step one, invest in training. Make sure both your development and testing teams have the skills needed to rock the shift left methodology. Education is key. Step two, integrate, integrate, integrate. Bring testing activities into the development process. Let's do them concurrently hand-in-hand hand with development. It's all about that seamless integration. Step three, collaborate like never before. Get your stakeholders on board, business analysts, developers, testers, everyone in the loop. When we are all aligned with the same goals, magical things happen. Step four, embrace the power of automation. Automation tools are your secret weapon for speedy and efficient testing. They help us avoid human error and get things done with lightning speed. Now let's talk about the disciplines you need to apply the shift left approach successfully. Buckle up because these practices are the real deal. First up, we have coding and code reviews. When writing code, we need to make sure it's testable and up to the standards. And that's not all. Code reviews play a vital role too. They help us catch any potential issues early on and ensure that the code is top notch. The second discipline is continuous integration. Here's the deal. You need to regularly integrate your code changes into the main branch. And after each integration, perform automated builds and tests. This helps us catch any integration issues swiftly and keeps our code base healthy. Test automation. This one's a personal favorite. With shift left testing, we create automation tests for every function, feature, or module of our software. By automating tests, we can test frequently and efficiently, saving us loads of time and effort. Discipline number four is continuous testing. We don't want to wait until the end of our development process 
to test everything. No way. We need to continuously test our code throughout the entire software development lifecycle. This ensures that our software remains stable at every stage, reducing those nasty surprises later on. Last, but definitely not least, we have collaboration and communication. It's all about working as a team. We need to integrate testing with development effectively and establish strong communication between our testing, development and operations teams. This way we can identify and resolve defects as early as possible. It's all about teamwork. In conclusion, adopting a shift left testing approach in your software development process brings numerous benefits, including early defect detection, faster time to market, higher customer satisfaction, reduced costs, and improved team morale. And if you want to discover the specific benefits after implementing the shift left strategy, click the article linked in the video description. Subscribe to the AquaCloud YouTube channel for more insights and stay tuned for continuous improvement in your testing processes. Happy testing and see you next time. Bye.